I want to start this video off by thanking you guys so much for 1,000 subscribers. The support has been so unreal. So in today's video, I will be revealing the ultimate advanced ISO Drobo tutorial you guys have been asking for. Now, I'm not going to lie. This is going to be an extremely advanced video. If you are new to the game, and you just want to learn the basic moves such as the curry slide. Then there's a bunch of dribbling tutorials on my channel. In the card up above, there is also a link to an old video where I showed you guys the six basic moves that you should learn right away. Also, I would recommend checking out my signature styles video if you haven't already since that will help you out so much and finally you must absolutely make sure that your post stick function is on default and your post stick orientation is on absolute if you don't do this you just won't be able to understand what's going on starting off with the first most important move and this is going to be the bd cancel for this move you need park size up 14 and hall of fame tight handle pretty much all you need to do is hold turbo and press your left stick down not like hold it down but literally press it down like it's a button after you've done that wait a split second and then hold your left stick down but but slightly towards your off ball hand for example if the ball is in my right hand i'll hold turbo press down on my left stick and then hold my left stick to around seven o'clock the next move is going to be the through the legs move to do this move you need to be running forward or mostly forward in the middle of the move you can go sideways but at the very beginning you need to be going forward then while holding turbo flick diagonally down towards your off ball hand like you're doing on behind the back and then flick up immediately so if the ball is in your left hand for example flick diagonally down to the right and then up for some reason in this game you need to do a move prior to doing this move such as the bd cancel you guys are going to see how all these moves can kind of connect to create like an ultimate combo this is going to be the step back that you get when you equip pro one size of skate package this is probably going to be the easiest move in the video basically all you need to do is without holding your left stick any direction just hold turbo and flick your right stick down this move honestly isn't that amazing by itself but it's an absolute kill when you combo it with a behind the back or through the legs first. The next move is going to be the turnaround half spin. To do this move, you need to be running backwards while holding turbo and rotate your right stick 45 degrees from the side to the top. So for example, if the ball is in my left hand, all I need to do is rotate my right stick from the left to the top. Remember that your player is running towards you, so you're going to be mirrored. Another move that you do need to learn is going to be the connectors, such as the sliding behind the back, for example. This is super important just to keep combos going. Basically, to do this sliding behind the back, you just need to hold your left stick the opposite direction that you're running while holding turbo. Also, make sure that you have the quick dribbling style in order to get this sliding behind the back. The next ISO move is going to be the ISO post spin. To do this move consistently, you need to hold left trigger without turbo. Then hold your left stick diagonally up to your off ball hand. You should get this little bit between the legs and then once you do have this animation rotate your right stick from the side to the top like you're doing a half spin but like to the other side for example if the ball is in my right hand i'll flick and hold my left stick to around 10 o'clock ish and then once i do get the between the legs i'm just gonna rotate my right stick from the four o'clock to 12 o'clock to do this move backwards you need to equip the basic one spin but i'm sure some of you guys can probably figure out how to do it without the basic one spin. the first thing that you're gonna want to do is do a basic spin then basically do the same thing that you did before but hold your left stick to around seven o'clock instead of 10 o'clock so for example if the ball's in my left hand i'll run straight without turbo and rotate my right stick from the right to the top then i'll wait a split second hold left trigger and wait another split second then i'm just gonna hold my left stick to seven o'clock and then once i've done that i'll go ahead and rotate my right stick from four to twelve the next move is going to be the explosive spin back from old 2ks the issue with this move is that you need the pro four spin before you spin back you need to do a standing moves such as a step back then run diagonally towards your ball hand and rotate your right stick from your off ball hand to the top so if the ball's in my left hand i'm gonna flick down to do a step back then i'm gonna hold turbo and run to around two o'clock and then after i've been running for a second i'll rotate my right stick from around eight to twelve o'clock the next move is going to be the between the legs quick stop essentially to do this move you need to be holding turbo and running to either side then once you're doing that just flick your right stick to your off ball hand and shoot so if the ball's in my left hand and i'm running to the left then i'm just gonna flick my right stick to the right wait a split second and then shoot the timing can be a little bit difficult so just experiment with it a little bit this can be an absolute kill out of the explosive spin back since you can essentially just turn around and shoot on the dime the next move is going to be the speed boost glitch 
privilege of next gen. To do this move, you need the John Wall signature size up. Basically, just hold turbo and hold your right stick up for a split second and then run to either side. So if the ball's in my left hand, I will hold turbo and hold my right stick up for a second and then run to either side. It's honestly pretty simple. This can be spammed and is an absolute kill if you add in the quick stop. I wasn't going to put this in the video initially, but a lot of people have been asking me how I fast momentum spam. I don't really know why there's a slow animation and a fast animation. To do the fast animation more consistently, you need to start the move with the momentum. For example, if you're doing another move first into the momentum, then you won't be able to do it. So just a double crossover into a momentum. Another tip that I have is to hold turbo and flick your right stick up instead to the side. To momentum crossover spam, you need to flick up on your right stick and then flick your left stick to your off ball hand. And then if you want to repeat it, just do the same thing again, but flick your left stick to the opposite side. It is pretty hard to spam at first, so you need to experiment with it a little bit. Try spamming it faster and then spam spamming it slower and just see what works for you. Anyways, so that's pretty much it for the video. If you did enjoy, consider subscribing to the channel. It's completely free and you can unsubscribe at any point in time. Like the video if you enjoyed it and I'll catch you guys in the next one. I'm out.